Party start. Right, lineouts were an issue. Wallabies win their first one. Lola Seal drops a little kick in behind. McKenzie and a good challenge in the air. And play on, says the referee. Wallabies inside the 22 with McDermott. Now Lola Seal throws another intercept. And they're not going to put him back either. Two weeks in a row, and it's Rico Yuani. They were never going to catch him. The kick was very good over the top yeah. from Val and Valentini and Co were chasing, but instead, off the second recycle, it doesn't go to an Australian hand. It goes to Rico Ioane, and the all-black midfielder goes the length. I saw it all the way too, Marshy, to Rico Ioane. He just looked at the eyes of Lolle Seal, read them beautifully, and then Rico Ioane. We know how quick he is. Line out's quick. Swinton wins it. Away it goes for Tuamua. Good thumping tackle by Papaliki. Now McDermott. Plenty of space to run. Straight up the middle goes Valentini. The big number eight forward takes it inside the 22. McDermott goes again. Inside to Banks, who's up on the line. Wallaby's getting a good feel for the ball early. Here's Valentini going again. He's impressive in this role of ball carrying. Now a short pass to Lachlan Swinton. McDermott goes himself right out in front of the goalpost here. Cleared away by Phillip. Now quarter Betty. Got away. Bit of a wheel spin, but still going the big man. Five metres away, as McDermott. Away for Painga Amosa. As the Wallabies again bring it out towards centre field. McDermott goes himself. Just short of the line. All Blacks coming in offside against Rika or Akira Ioane. Now the little kick through. Here's Callaway. Callaway! Beautiful! <laughs> what a good try that is! Man, that's some sort of try. Here's Connor Betty. He shakes off Dalton Papali'i. Not many do that. He can't hang on. That's how powerful he is. He's well over the advantage line. McDermott had another dig at the line. Two steps, bang, there he goes. Tucks the ball. Takes a good tackle to get him. They step in for the recycle. Lolo Seals in the pocket. Pinpoint perfect. Callaway's got work to do. Oh, some quality. Some quality, KT. Oh, yeah, back to back tries and consecutive weekends. Callaway, there's the back end of it, but it's all the hard work done at the breakdown. They were challenging the All Blacks when they had ball, but when they had their own ball, they were absolutely staunch in that area. The Wallabies cleaning out quick ball. Got a Betty put a shot on Will Jordan. Quick tap from Banks out to Lolo Seal. Looking to expose the All Blacks out wide, and they give Cora Betty a bit of space. And he's contained nicely by Havili. Real danger out on the left wing side. Here's uh, charging in on it with Swinton, but he's lost the ball. So the referee will play an advantage here for the knock-on. And might even be down to a penalty advantage now as Ioani, the try scorer, gets it away to his brother. Bit of space. Now Reese. Now they're winding up. McKenzie there. Flips it to Ratalik. Oh, this is a great try. Brody Ratalik. Position <laughs> of space was absolutely outstanding that's the pass from Rico Tirakera that got him outside Valentini he got in the space McKenzie put through and McDermott and then big Ritalik underneath the black dot is there once again now the looking to make the clearance oh. and no look at the touchline at all it's all about bombing in the midfield boy a dangerous man though here he goes looking to link up but he couldn't find reese on his left so smith gives it off to whitelock turn gives it back to savia fights a couple of meters downfield now smith again good strong charge there from laulala smith again first receiver habili cut down on a good tackle by slipper ball is there again for smith again it's whitelock as they take it out in front of the posts. Smith again for Savia. Finds McKenzie. Short for Moonga. He in turn gives Papali'i a good pass. Five metres away. All Blacks look to move it a couple of extra metres. Now, Ioani. Still going. Try scored. But double time when you've got the likes of Mwanga cutting open the defense which gets players on the front foot all of his razzle dazzle and getting it over the ad line top passes Papali'i does well but as I was going to say when Savia gets an assist like this from Cody Taylor impossible to stop
was the first time the Australians have kicked badly and it was in their own 22. So the end result, Richie Moonga cars him up and Adi Sabi head down. Too good that close. This looks more organised. Valentini holds it. Again, the scrum screws, but McDermott's off on a little run. McDermott, under the post, he goes the little halfback. He came back to the left, so you can see there, he just out to the right, and then he decides to go back. Aaron Smith has to take Valentini. Papa Lili drifted wide, left foot step, Australia go in. He's been strong around the rucks and in this contact area this first 40 minutes, hasn't he? Tate McDermott, he gets the Aussies right back in it. He's up challenging, but White Luck was good enough to bring it down. So it should be there for Smith. They've got a penalty advantage here. Goal Off on it goes for here. Taylor. You've got advantage, nine. And he sets it for Smith. Away for Akira Yuani. Still playing advantage. He's got the ball in hand a lot tonight. Smith goes on a little dab, and off goes Smith. He's got words on the one man, Taylor the other, and Cody Taylor's in position and pounced you can see there he gets stuck which meant McDermott had to try and cover both he didn't Smith went through he had two to pick from McDermott did well to cover Jordan but he couldn't get to Taylor oh there was a couple of tired defenders there from Australia you can see there he just isolates McDermott does Aaron Taylor had options inside out and Coley Taylor how good well a seal stop goal and Banks is going to run onto this and good contest being no, snapped up by Pasami, so the Wallabies have it. And uh, away it goes. The long pass! They've done it again! This time it is Sebu Reese. Out of the that zone. You've got to be sure that you can get the ball. You can see Sebu Reese waits, watches, bang! The minute that it goes just over the head of Valentini, I think it was, he pounces, never stopping him from there. There's a double pull ball. There was a second one. He reads it beautifully, Seve Reese, because he's back, because he's got the depth. And at the moment, Seve Reese, but he's straight fire. Right, this time. Smith rolls it in, comes back quickly, away for Havili. Put some pressure on the opposition. They've got him up off the ground. Now it's gone to ground. As Smith swings it wide for Taylor. Cody Taylor's in again. Slides through and scores. Well, as long as they don't go back and look at it, there's a potential for the slide in over the line. This is the potential. David Havili gets hit high. McDermott's yeah, over the top. He does here. drop the ball. I think it gets dragged forward by a leg, not by a hand or anything yep. else. Look at this pass, so Marshy from Aerosmith again. Thanks, Glenn. Right on the money. Tokiaho with the throw. Nicely taken in by no, Scott Barrett. Play. Now, Tokiaho makes a run downfield, gathers a couple of meters in. Now it's there for Smith on to White Lock. Suddenly it's with Papaliki bouncing out of the tackle. And here's Savia on the charge. He's got Jordan with him. Delivers the pass. Will Jordan scores his inevitable try. And Australia are on the rack now, big time. Superb from Papaliki inside to Savia. Bang, bang, gets rid of two defenders. Sums up the last one, holds Kotobiti long enough for Jordan to get on the outside, pin his ears back. Man, that's good, KT. They are starting to show the razzle-dazzle this team's got. Oh, razzle, all right, Marshy, 7 to 8. Adi Savia looking nice and strong and fast as well. Just powers out of that tackle from McDermott. Sizes up the situation, deadly. And Will Jordan, well, we all know from here, he is absolutely deadly. Jordan Alessi to throw. Salakai Lotto drags it down for the Wallabies. Gonna have a crack at the All Black Pack here. 
just getting a bit dangerously close towards the sideline but a bit hard to know where the ball is three or four pods of players now white has it sends it wide for Tuco, who of course is a specialist close to the line short for valentini he's voluntarily overwhelmed now white goes again hooper serves it up for salakai lotto advantage ball is there the all blacks have been penalized though so the referee will let this go a little bit longer we've got advantage, Wilson we've got advantage. in the red headgear now white looks away quick hands oh, all on a CO. and the long pass across callaway gets a couple for the night and uh, the wallabies are in I to a wide receiver was outstanding nice for Philip out the back Lola Seal with the dead bang in comes the defender Geordie Barrett but he has the presence of mind Banks to shift it in the contact look at this at the same time as he gets hit by Bowden Barrett I should say gets it into space KT oh yeah he takes his medicine to there Marshy Tom Banks that is a tough board as you spoke about 15 meters on the money and he's good enough to score there Andrew Callaway great execution white block Happy to keep playing, both teams. Little jab through by Bowden Barrett. Bounce is okay. Nice work from Banks. Freed it away to Callaway. Ball knocked on. Here's trouble. Here's Jordan. Can't find anybody. Pops it up in the end for Havili. Havili! He'll go all the way. Ho oh ho! Wreck them alike. Couldn't quite handle it, the Wallabies. Jordan picks it up, turns two to three defenders inside out, doesn't die with the ball wandering, pops it up to Harvey. Okay, so Little yeah, step, nice. accelerate, slides his way in. Yes, boy! It's finished time for the All Blacks. They put the Bledisloe Cup back into the cabinet. Oh, lock it up, Marsh. You know, I think this try just typifies the attitude of this All Black team tonight from minute one to minute 83. David Harvey, he's going to get the tick. Oh, how good. Despair.